If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit that bell so you can receive notification every time I release a video. Let's get going. Arteries of the hand region. 14 questions and answers. Are palmar vessels of the hand subdivided into superficial, deep, and single dorsal layers? Yes, the palmar vessels of the hand are subdivided into superficial, deep, and single dorsal layers. Which two bones in the hand are penetrated by the radial artery? Radial artery penetrates between the hand's first and second metacarpal bones. Does the radial artery enter the palm? Yes, the radial artery enters the palm. Does the radial artery form the deep palmar arch upon entering the palm? Yes, upon entering the palm, the radial artery forms the deep palmar arch. Does the radial artery give rise to a superficial branch before entering the snuff box? Yes, the superficial branch of the radial artery arises before the radial artery enters the snuff box. Does a superficial branch of the radial artery arise before entering the snuff box at the distal end of the radius? Yes, the radial artery, superficial branch, arises at the distal radius level before the radial artery enters the snuff box. Which muscle does the superficial branch of the radial artery travel over after the snuff box? After the snuff box, the superficial branch of the radial artery travels over the abductor pollicis brevis muscle. Does the superficial branch of the radial artery contribute to the superficial palmar arch? Yes, the superficial branch of the radial artery contributes to the superficial palmar arch. Does the superficial branch of the radial artery contribute to the skin over the thinae area? Yes, the superficial branch of the radial artery contributes to the skin over the thinner area. Does the radial artery's superficial branch contribute to the thumb's core intrinsic muscles? Yes, the radial artery's superficial branch contributes to the thumb's core intrinsic muscles. Does the ulna artery in the hand divide into a deep and superficial palmar branch? Yes, the ulna artery in the hand divides into a deep and superficial palmar branch.
Does the superficial branch of the ulna artery become the dominant contributor to the superficial palmar arch? Yes, the superficial branch of the ulna artery becomes the dominant contributor to the superficial palmar arch. Does the superficial arch cross the palm at the level of a fully abducted thumb? Yes, at the level of a fully abducted thumb, the superficial arch crosses the palm. Do deep branches of the ulna artery contribute to the deep palmar arch? Yes, the deep branches of the ulna artery contribute to the deep palmar arch.